Europe is being held back by an aging power system. With pressure being put on it by increasing demand, the chances of the lights going off have never been greater. Old systems mean that when demand rises, overheated transmission lines are more likely to cause component failures and blackouts. Some firms are looking at new technologies that can increase the capacity and flexibility of networks. RWE in Germany are working with cable specialists on what they call the superconductor. A superconductor is a perfect conductor of electricity. It will carry electricity without any loss. But with the current technology, which, I, which is based on copper on, uh, on aluminium, in fact, you are limited in current. So you typically cannot go beyond 2,000 amps. So the idea is that you can enter uh, city center at a lower voltage because you are able to, to carry more current through the superconducting cable. Carrying current on a lower voltage is much more efficient and could potentially save energy firms lots of money. Nexons are testing their cable in the German city of Essen. Currently the longest high temperature superconductor in the world, Nexons say it will be able to transport at least a hundred times more electricity than a standard copper cable. What is special about this project is it's the first project this kind worldwide because it's a real application, it's connecting two substation on the medium voltage side. In the long term we expect it to be cheaper than conventional systems. So while this is being done in Germany, can it be applied elsewhere? The concept which we apply in Essen can be applied in every major city as well because the distribution systems in the cities are very similar. Tom Gibson, Energy Live News.